Okay, right. Just like we thought. There's an alarm on the grate. We'll have to bypass it. Dr. Tassoni gave me this to pass to you. It's a resonance emitter lens. It should let you see security grids and wiring. Good. I'll follow the wiring to a junction box, splice it, and disable the alarm. Yeah. Fingers crossed. The lens is working. Good. Follow the blue wiring. In case it needs to be said, don't try to bypass a camera while you're being watched. I see a junction in the wall, but there's a camera watching it. Shepard, I'm sending a hack to your Omnitool. It will fool the camera, but it'll self-delete after a few seconds. Got it. I forget how to use it. Oh. The splice is in. Good. I've got the grate open, and... In we go. Act casual. This could take a while. Excuse me, I think I saw someone doing drugs in the ladies' room. I see. Were you able to identify the substance used? Red sand. Dispatch, we've got a sand tripper in the bathrooms. Have they tried to compromise the games bionically? Unknown at this time. Moving to confront. Send backup. We're taking care of it, ma'am. Appreciate the help. You have a good night, now. You're clear, Brooks. See if I can get to the panic room. Then I'll get back to blending in. Slow and steady. We'll get to Khan. Talk to me, Brooks. I've got a pressure pad and an obstruction detector ahead. I can't disable them from here. Okay. Edie, I need a tech solution. Brooks, stay put. We'll find some junctions and take down the sensors. Okay. I'm at a junction. There's a camera and a guard. I'll just be here. Try not to cough. I need to look at your kitchen. I'm a food inspector. Uh, <clears throat> I'm going to have to see some credentials. This way. Brooks, try it now. <laughs> Checking the pressure pad. No alarms. Looks good. Follow the red wiring. All right, there's a second one. Uh, well, then I'm gonna hack this ATM first. You think I'm gonna come to a casino and not rob it? I wanna distract. Hey, okay. you call that guarding? Is there a problem you'd like to report, sir? You call that guarding? I'm at the storage room grate. Time to hit the lock. Be careful, Brooks. Brooks? What? What happened? Infrared laser hooked up to a silent alarm. I didn't get it in time. Shepard, I'll call the responding guard to say it was a false alarm, but you must stall him before he reaches Brooks. Hey! 
Just calm down. I'm trying to do three different things here. Barrels? Sir, we checked out the alarm in storage. It's nothing. Minor accident. Find out who tripped it and get them in my office by end of shift. Now you. What'd you need? Oh, I'm sorry. Are, are you a security? I thought you were a friend of mine. You've got the same suit. You... Enjoy your evening. <laughs> You're clear, Brooks. Don't just say that right in front of him. I'll see if I can get to the panic room. I can't get the security gate to open from here. The junction must be on your side. It might be tricky. Just so you know. Have a little faith. I can get his attention and say, Hey, you call that right. Is there a problem you'd like to suspicious activity? My floor. The thing about Solarian parties is, they all do it too well. I don't follow. My lab group on Sirkesh. All Solarians but me, and all with damn near perfect memories. Oh, that could get awkward. Exactly. It was all about who burnt the cake six months ago, or arguments the two people continue when they meet up once a year. So they never let anything go? Yeah, it was constant one-upmanship. I couldn't keep pace with them if I wanted to. Poor guy. Hey, you call that guarding? Is there a problem you'd like to report, sir? God, don't turn around right now. Suspicious activity. My floor. A guard spotted me. If you act normal, hopefully he'll move on. So you don't miss Sir Kesh at all? Not the humidity and not the lack of privacy. But the science was uh, like nowhere else. What did you work God on? Damn it. And what didn't we? Food scanners for the paranoid, chemical bonders, self-cleaning mating pools. Learned a lot, huh? For the mating pools, uh, way more than I wanted to know. <clears throat> Try this again. Hey, you call that guarding? Is there a problem you'd like to report, sir? Hit him with the same line, Rex. I'll never suspect it. Con, you and me are gonna have a talk. What the hell? Hmm. You got me dressed up like this, and someone else got to do the shooting. Rex not happy. <laughs> Commander, there's a deletion order on the terminal. Damn it. Everything's been wiped. I don't know if it was him or the killer or... <gasps> when I tripped that alarm, did I screw this up? What are you looking for? Mistakes. Thought so. Whoever it was had to do this fast. They wiped the terminal, but not the comm. Oh, so we can take the comm back to the safe house to scan it, or... Elijah. Come crawling back? Guess again. You. I see you've recovered from flopping on the floor like a fish. You'll need to do better than that. The last guy that trash talked to me was a few kilometers taller than you. Brave. I thought as much, but it won't matter. You have nothing. All you can do is wait for the hammer to fall. <laughs> Bring a bigger hammer. Your last try was inadequate. I'm gonna take everything you have, and everything you are. Damn it! <sighs> Sorry, Commander. There wasn't enough time to trace the call. We're not finished. Pull out the data drives. The ones that got wiped? You think we can find something? With Edie, anything's possible. 
The sooner we get them to her, the sooner we can track down this threat. Hell of a party. Almost as good as Krogan do it. Doesn't count unless the host dies at the end. It wasn't a total loss. Brooks, work with Edie to see if there's anything useful on those drives. Here's hoping. I'll let you know what we find, Commander. I could go for some food while we wait. Too bad you shot the hell out of the best sushi place in the Citadel, huh? I mean, there's pizza, Joker. I hope Brooks and Edie can find something on the drive. Same here. I hear it was quite the party, even if things didn't go exactly as planned. At least you didn't come away empty-handed. <laughs> so I see how it is, Shepard. Go out for a night on the town and leave the boyfriend behind in the closet. It's okay. I'm not one for mingling, unless the mingling involves sniper rifles. I think we've got something, Commander. I am glad to see my physical proximity was not necessary to the success of the mission, Shepard. Let's see what you find before we call it a win. Commander, Edie and I have been analyzing those drives. I think we found something if you're ready. Let's hear it. Though the data's root structure was erased, the logic integrity remains viable. Edie has an incredible talent for this stuff. I know she's an AI, but even still. We found an encrypted communication from a few days ago. Just need another minute to crack it. A whole minute? Edie here could shave that down to five seconds. I thought it best to allow staff analyst Brooks a chance to improve her decryption skills. And now you've lost your chance to show off. Like she needs it. You're the crew of the Normandy. You're legends to the rest of the Alliance. It's all just part of the job. Wait. Job? You mean the rest of you are getting paid for this? Here we go. <laughs> wow. Those marks who were after you? They bought a lot of weapons. Like, big ones. Mechs? Why would they need that kind of firepower? Glyph? Have you found something? I have just monitored the Commander's Spectre access code in use at the Citadel Archives. Punch it up. The Archives are going into emergency lockdown. Where is hacking your records is there right now? What do we know about the place? Council keeps sensitive historical information there. Real hush-hush. Even my old CSEC clearance never got me in. Then we'll find our own way in. Gear up and let's... What's with the Volus? Oh, pizza delivery guy. I got the munchies. <sighs> Double pepperoni. These archives are huge. You'll have a lot of ground to cover. Shame you can't bring everyone. Who says we can't? All hands on deck for this one. Hell yeah, but uh, who gets to take point with you? Who's going to pay the bill? Man, James is such a dick, he got pizza and didn't even get enough for everybody. One large pizza is not going to be enough to feed one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, plus myself, plus Brooke, nine people. One large is not going to cut it. One large double pepperoni is wholly inadequate. I can eat a large double pepperoni. I can eat two large double pepperonis, right? That is me personally, and I'm not Commander Shepard. This group would need at least... at least six pizzas. The best way into the archives. The facility is located below the wards. Maybe a direct breach for maximum surprise? I like it. Sounds like you're learning the ropes. Hell, hang out with us long enough and you'll learn ropes, knives, bombs, thresher maws. <laughs> oh. Don't hang out too long. Pretty soon you'll be making friends with Asari. I heard that. The archives are somewhere below us. 
It could be pretty tricky to get in there. Not really. Krogan first! See you at the party, princesses! So that guy, he's the shuttle pilot, and he's actually a character I'm supposed to care about. And I don't remember him, I forget his name, and I generally just forget about his existence unless I'm actively talking to him. I forget what his name is, but he's there, and that's who that is. Not this again. Ambush! Why don't I start with this guy? Better and take cover! In the old days, we had at least five minutes before a mission went south. Jump up front, the full crew! Box with it! Shit, we got a Krogan! Brooks, you okay? Upstairs! Scattering and taking cover! <laughs> That's enough! Drop your weapons or this won't end well for her. You bitch. All right. <laughs> Whatever you think you're getting away with. There's nowhere you can run, nowhere you can hide where we can't find you. Hide? Why? I'm Commander Shepard. I never hide. Uh-huh. So that's how it's gonna be. Who are you? You weren't the only shepherd that Cerberus brought back to life. But at least one of us will finally do something with it. If you're really me, then we're on the same team. Pfft. Hardly. I was created for spare parts. In case you needed another arm, or a heart, or a lung. A clone? Did the elusive man send you? No. He abandoned me when he had what he wanted. You. Then why try to kill us? I like how you're because shorter I don't than me. That's nice. I'd never fool my supposed friends. The ones who abandoned their duty to join the cult of Shepard. Like you, Garrus Vagarian. You're nothing more than a burnt out cop past his prime. And you're just a pale imitation of the real thing. I'm the real thing. Perfected. I'm you without the wear and tear, Shepard. The doubts, the failures. I'm the lone wolf you were always meant to be. Without the emotional baggage holding me back. No one will ever believe your Shepard. They will when I'm flying her ship. This is Shepard. Initiate Normandy lockdown. Transmitting command codes now. That was pretty dumb of Good me. idea. Too bad the signal was blocked. Trainer, this is Shepard. Prep the Normandy for emergency departure. We're leaving. I'm sending the command codes now. Acknowledged. We'll get underway. Never thought I'd say it, but I'm looking forward to killing myself. I guess ominous threats of violence run in our DNA. But mine is more than a threat. Execute them. The cult of Shepard ends today. Now 
At this point, anything's possible. You mean like finding out you have a clone? I don't want to talk about it. Right. At least not till we've all had a stiff drink. How are we gonna find anything in this place? Glyph? Yes, Commander. Track the target. Give me updates on its location. What is the nature of the target? She looks like me. Then I have found the target. No, Glyph. It's another me. Now get going. At once, Commander. Bye, guys. Now, if you get into the vault, we can move you across. Accessing vault T ninety one. Check this out. Says this gun was part of the first contact war. Year twenty one fifty seven. First time my people met your Shepard. Naturally, bullets were involved. This is the best assault rifle in the game. Where is it? Hell yeah. Alright, ditch this. This guy. Commander, the other you is searching for something 200 meters ahead. Got it. Fighting your own clone. Pretty crazy, even by our standards. It may prove useful. Once the clone is physically dominated, it could be assigned to perform unpleasant tasks. So, like a personal butler? I don't want to talk about it. Right. So let your clone do it. This gun has no ammo capacity and doesn't need to reload and has really high damage and accuracy it's just honestly the best gun in the game same thing with the pistol Dagger squad i need more time to reach the vault keep shepherd off my back or i'll have your head the other shepherd sounds like an asshole <laughs> i quit if she was my commander also just sounds fantastic Let it recharge. Let it recharge still. Ah, no. She's dead. Oh, Rex got went and killed everybody by itself. Oh.
This is gonna suck. Jesus, Rex. They're just fighting dirty. This is Shepard. We need to. That's why I love hanging out with you guys. Why shoot something once when you can shoot it 46 more times? The other me can't be far. Keep up the pressure, and we'll try to surround her. Let's move. Year 2157 CE. First contact war. Turian interrogation. Vault T-91. Sir, we captured this human in the occupation of Shangxi. A human? You're the first I've met. And you're the first bird I've met. He was armed with this weapon, sir. How primitive. Your kind expects to win a war with this. A bullet is a bullet. You have so much to learn. And when we conquer your Earth, I look forward to teaching you. I'd like to point out that the first contact war was, historically, an enormous human victory. Because what happened was, so humans find a mass relay outside of Mars. Can you imagine the history in this place? Must stretch back thousands of years. I just wonder what the other me is looking for in here. Humans start exploring the galaxy, which violates, like, and accidentally violate a bunch of laws. So the Turians, like, move to aggressively stop them. Naturally, we don't like that, so we start a war. And so in universe the Turian military they have like compulsory military service for every Turian and they have the biggest military in the entire citadel and like the best military um and the humans who had just discovered mass technology didn't have all the advanced citadel technology still absolutely destroyed them um which is super cool year 700 CE Krogan rebellions attack on council vault K306 this is the only visual record of Krogan Overlord Kredik's attack on the Council. Audio follows. I've heard enough. If the Krogan hadn't taken on the Rachni, you would all be at their mercy. You won't give us what we deserve, and so you force us to take it. We will never leave the planet of Lucia, no matter how much the Asari cry. Ambassador Kredik, you only weaken your case with this show of violence. Wrong, Solarian. Now our case is finally strong. Negotiations are over! Malfunction detected. Malfunction detected. Malfunction detected. Please contact maintenance. Broken plane! <laughs> this is happening! Enemy contact ahead, yeah. Shepard! They'll draw their fire! <laughs> Someone can try! Upstairs. 
Oh, God damn it. Holy shit. You mess with Shepard, you mess with me. I guess I hit the two at once. Uncle Erdnot has a present for you. Pushing ahead. Removal of illegal AIs. Vault C940. These are the last of the AIs on the Citadel. This termination action is unlawful. Why do you continue when our appeal has not yet been heard? Keep quiet. You know that the council will never overturn its own edict. Standing by for your go, sir. Do not terminate us. Go. If Edie sees that, she says something, I think. Recognized. Commander Shepard. The following information is classified. The unknown aggressor is suspected to be a Reaper aided in its attack on the Citadel by rogue Spectre Saren. The Reaper Sovereign is destroyed by the Fifth Fleet. Searching for a secret vault. She did not wish to be disturbed. What? I thought she was you. Go find her again. Poor Glyph. and you end up in a mech fight. You're welcome, Team Mako. Thanks, guys. Good luck. Holy 
Holy shit, Rex, just take it. Commander, a large contingent of soldiers calling themselves Razor Squad is just ahead. They wish to inflict bodily harm on you. Also, I discovered an Elcor mating totem in Vault 347B. Fascinating. I like how, how Glyph is trying to tell them like why they should join the Alliance, we're just killing them. Just yell, I cease to exist. What did she smoke bombed? What a nerd. Looks like we're clear. Looks like I saved everyone's ass again. <laughs> Hammerhead and Mako, keep pushing ahead. Right. I might throw up a little bit now if that's okay with everyone. Commander, the other you wishes to pass on a message. Shepard, save yourself the trouble. Once I have what I came here for, you won't matter anymore. Now go, drone. Deliver it. Your 710 CE, Krogan Genophage. Deployment, Vault T101. We have our orders. Release of the Genophage against the Krogan has been authorized. Not by my government. Your government invented it. What good is a weapon if you don't use it? Sergeant Tavis, restrain him. Are we sure of our orders, sir? This is genocide. Sergeant Hout, restrain them both. I'll press the button myself. One day, Solarian, you will thank us. Dispersal commencing. Your 693CE, First Spectre. Below Gear J recruitment, Vault S1. Below Gear J. You are accused of using 30 civilians as bait to flush out and assassinate your target. I knew they'd survive. Probably. You're being released. The Council wants you to implement a new special tactics and reconnaissance group. Desk job? No, thank you. This is no desk job. Spectres will be the best of the best. They will operate with impunity and answer only to the Council. You will be the first. Now that sounds like the best job offer in the galaxy. Help me in. The next person who says that is fired! It appears the other commander has a bad temper. Collateral damage does not concern her.
Team Hammerhead, we're headed to the next level. What's your location? Hammerhead, do you copy? There's Team Mako. We'll try to clear a path, Commander. Hammerhead's gone ahead. <laughs> to smoke grenade go off oh. Observations suggest that their role seems to be that of some sort of guardian. We will begin our exploration. Team Mako, we're coming up behind. What's your status? We're under! Mako, where are you? It's weird to think like how much of the Citadel was built and how much was here already. You're 2183 CE. First Human Spectre Deliberations, Vault SH-1. Commander Shepard's recent accomplishments are not in question. It's her background that the Council has no knowledge of. Shepard was born to a career military family, growing up on various Alliance postings until enlisting at the age of 18. Anything from Shepard's military record that you'd like to call out? The Alliance considers Shepard their go-to soldier that gets the job done no matter the cost. Ruthless, calculating, and brutal. Thank you for your presentation, and to all who spoke. The Council will render their decision on the suitability of Commander Shepard as Spectre within the day. Not quite sure those are really positively connotated adjectives that Commander, I'd want somebody to reference me with. What's your status? The other you is jamming our radios. Hammerhead and Mako are trying to get ahead and cut her off. But I've been hit and need help. Please hurry. That can't be good. Brooks, the vault sealed us in. Is there an override? I'm not seeing one. Cortez! Brooks! Do you read me? Is anyone on this frequency? The short answer is no. They're not. The longer answer involves your friends trapped in Iridium vaults and forgotten for... Well, forever. Others know about this. About you. The Alliance will stop you. What do you think, Staff Analyst Brooks? Will the Alliance stop us? I wouldn't know. I don't actually work for them. <laughs> the best. Uh, although I do find it very unreasonable that we never bothered to like check to make sure on her. Who the hell are you? And do you really think I won't track you down? My name doesn't matter. I never keep the same one for more than a few days. And if the elusive man hasn't found me yet, you never will. Your Cerberus? Was. Mr. Elusive and I didn't see eye to eye. He is indoctrinated. Whereas I prefer the whispers in my head to be my own. Why not come to me? We could have worked together. In a way, we did. I'm the one who put together all those dossiers on your suicide mission. The collector base? There was the Salarian Doctor, the Asari Justicar, the Turian. 
Nice to have finally met you, Archangel. Charmed. They were all mistakes. We were a pro-human group who started looking to aliens for help. So I bided my time. And when I found another you who agreed, I woke her up. So you're just a racist. The minute, the second I get out of here, I'm gonna take your head and mount it in the Normandy CIC. Then I'm gonna mount her head next to yours. Then I'm gonna take both your heads and space them out the airlock. That before I ground their skulls to dust. That sounds very dramatic. And if someone like, say, Commander Shepard made the threat, I'd be worried. But you're not Shepard. Not anymore. You had Miranda, I have her. Mine has more bite. It was fun while it lasted. What are you doing? <laughs> Setting things right. Remember this? You were the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. Except somewhere along the way, you forgot about your entire species. You've saved more alien lives than you have human. And all I've seen you do is end lives. You're gonna make a lousy me. <laughs> you know the one thing they can't duplicate? Our handprint. Life gives it its shape, not DNA. Which is a problem. Computer, update council records. Subject, Shepard, human specter. Accessing record. Please input new data. Biometric identifier updated. Good day, Commander Shepard. Now, if you'll excuse me, the Normandy needs its captain. So, uh... I should go. Farewell, Commander. I guess this is where legends go to die. Refresh my memory. Didn't we used to win these things back in the old days? She said I should go. Do I sound like that? As long as I've known you, yeah. Crazy thought, but maybe we should be worrying about this impregnable vault we've been sealed inside forever. I'm more confident than she is. More in control. With me, it's more like, that's all for now. Spoken like a Krogan. Show who's boss. Probably not a lot of air in here either. An hour, if we're lucky. Or sometimes I'll talk to you later. Because, you know what, I never do. Leave them wanting more. Yeah, I should... Shepard, please, why aren't you more worried about this? Hmm? Oh, Glyph, you still out there? Yes, Commander. Unlock this damn thing and go find the others. No one steals my ship, not even me. I've got room for Shepard plus two. And figure it out fast because the other Shepard is stealing my ship. What? Oh, I was hoping to go. Yeah, I, I never seem to get picked. Joker will come There's a reason back for, for you, that, promise. James. So Garrus has pulled his disappearing act again. This is why I hate Shorely. I swear you parked the ship for five minutes. Can you contact Citadel Flight Control and get them to deny the departure request? Try. All the comm lines in the area are jammed. Probably to make it easier for them to steal my ship. We'll stop them. Shepard, your clone has entered the ship and is attempting to... Oh. She's supposed to do that? I'm okay. Really? The clone has disabled my control of the Normandy. 
as well as all sensory input. I cannot lock her out or counteract her commands. You still fit for duty? I am experiencing a significant feedback loop in my head and an increased desire to kill your clone. Get in line. Well, whatever you do, hurry. If the Normandy gets to FTL, we may never see her again. It's not gonna happen. Okay, Citadel systems are targeting the car. Any closer and they open fire. Get back and pick up the others ASAP. Right, they can't have gotten far, unless they called a cab or something. Good, I needed to kill something. Bad place to be. Oh, come on. Rex. Thank you, Rex. God, that's a rag doll. Fuck out.
When we want to take off, there's a half hour of pre-flight checks. They just gun the engine and go? Most of those checks are actually unnecessary. Thanks for letting me know. Send a warning to the Normandy. We can't. Toes are jammed, remember? Damn it. This far just to watch the Normandy leave. And I don't even. Wait. What? You were just on the Normandy. You. You fired me. Dishonorable discharge for conduct unbecoming. You kicked me off the ship with barely enough time to grab my toothbrush. My favorite thing is if uh, you have Trina romance, you fire her instead for um, improper fraternization or something like that. I can't fire you without a disciplinary hearing trainer. And really? The first thing you grab is your toothbrush? It's a Scission Pro Mark IV. It uses Mass Effect fields to break up plaque. And someone just threw me off the ship. If it wasn't you... Shepard's got a clone. Makes sense when you think about it. I can explain more later. For now... <clears throat> it's sealed. Engines are online. They are preparing to take off. Is there anyone still aboard who can help us? No. I was only there because I helped with the Normandy retrofits back on Earth. Everyone else is on shore leave. I need another way onto the ship, and I need it fast. There's an emergency exit hatch for evacuations. It should be right... here. Manual lock, and it's only meant to be open from the other side. Any ideas? Triggering it would require extremely precise mass effect field manipulation. If you told me this morning that a toothbrush was going to save the Normandy, I'd have been very skeptical. All right, like canonically, this is all happening in like one night or like one night in a day or something like that. this way. Wouldn't you rather take her down yourself? Armory, find her. Slow her down. I like how the orders aren't stop her, it's slow her down. Pretty sure we broke trainer's toothbrush getting the hatch open. Remind me to reimburse her for that. Shepard? Later. Remind me later. A little cramped in here. Quiet. Can't risk them hearing us up top. Yeah, yeah. Get off my tail. Alright, get a patrol going. Find Shepard. The real one. Hey, what you mean by slow her down? We're about to kill Shepard if we have to, right? She said slow her down because she thinks we're cannon. That did not go as planned.
God, fuck off. That did not go as planned either. I can't go up that way. That's awkward. I want to take cover. or control. I feel blind. That must be strange. Good luck with that. Thank you. <laughs> Let's get to the cargo bay. <laughs> that must be strange. Good luck with that. <laughs> oh, Rex does what we all want to do. Holy shit. showing disrespect to my home, my body. It is unacceptable. I can imagine. I intend to kill Shepard's clone, Agent Brooks, and anyone else in my way. You're okay, Edie. That's creepy. <laughs> you want to stop shooting up my ship? It's not your ship. It will be. I've taken your name, your specter rank, even your fingerprints. And then you left me to die. Only I didn't. You think fake fingerprints are going to fool the council or hack it? Big plan looking now. Ha! Hatchet squad to the shuttle bank. Alright. Oh, right. This fight's annoying because your clone actually has like metagel. that I do. Okay, seriously? Fuck off. God damn it. I hadn't gotten caught out in the melee for so long. I think I just mashed F. I actually don't remember. She just bull rushes me. Nope, okay, she doesn't have my same abilities, so I don't have that one. Plan B. Plan B. That's an 
that's not doing. The plan was actually pretty shitty. Oh god! Hi! I wouldn't necessarily call it death from starvation slash lack of oxygen. Bio will be able to make a boss fight for the boss is just not immune to all your abilities for no good reason. God damn it. Like, seriously, what the fuck? Like, at this point, she is better than me because she can just spam her abilities five times in a row. access to every ability in the game apparently. For that damage. We need to stay within 30 degrees of the nose to block course plotting. That makes us a perfect target. No, that makes us the bait. Do you want me to drive? No. Damn it. Launch the shuttle and blow that thing out of the sky. You're just 
got those scars? Feral and Novaria and Burmire and Ilo. And the Collector Base and Taliban and Chaka and Renner and Thexia. I earned these scars protecting the galaxy. You got yours from a petri dish. <laughs> It's a good thing we're not wearing the same armor. What a shitty force field that is. Look at you. What makes you so damn special? Why you and not me? Hang on! We have you. Here, take my hand. And then, and then you live. For what? That's going to be an awkward news story. Fortunately, they weren't here long enough to do much real damage. Although I may need some help from James cleaning up the damage to the shuttle bay. Plus, they overloaded the heat diffusion system firing at us. Not sure if you noticed, but shuttle guy here did some crazy stunt flying to keep us in one piece. That's nice to fly something a little more maneuverable than the Kodiak. How about you, Edie? I am once again in control of the Normandy. Thank you for asking. Glad to hear it. What about the Mercs? Any survivors? Just one crappy-ass pilot and her. Alliance has taken her to a high-security facility. Maybe she can give them some dirt on Cerberus. I'll be more than happy to cooperate with the authorities. Until you escape. Me? Escape? But I'm not a field agent. Stop. Just stop. You betrayed me and the Alliance in the middle of a war. I was young and naive. Admit it, Commander. You'll miss me. No. Not at this range, I won't. Uh, maintenance to the shuttle bay? The rest of the squad's waiting outside. We'll have the Normandy back in shape in no time. I thought that was the clone for a second there, because it was just Trainer, because Trainer also looks a lot like me. <laughs> Appreciate it. Is sure leave always like this? <laughs> Come on, maybe we can take some actual time off. No explosions or anything. Just us. Don't know about no explosions, but 
just us sounds perfect.